Welcome back to Digital Design Digest. For anybody who's taken photography on the fly of events, uh, you know, whether it be family, business, um, or in this case, even your pets, again, you can get some very great, clear shots and still have a little trouble with the coloring because of the lighting situation you find yourself in. That's very easily correctable here in iPhoto. You can see in looking at the shot, it's one a little dark so we're going to correct for the exposure on this but it also has a little bit of a blue hue and we can correct that and balance out the color so we bring out the true tones in this cat's eyes and in his coat so we're going to go in to down just down here to the bottom of the screen and hit the adjust button and we're looking at our top here of our adjustment panels at levels. And so the first thing we're going to do is just correct a little bit for the exposure. Better bring out some of the, the highlights and shadows. You can see that already that adds some definition and uh, especially to the gorgeous markings. The next thing we're going to do is just go down here and play around a little bit with the shadows and highlights and see if we can't add just a little bit more brightness and we'll also add a bit more definition here. But to deal with what still is just a little bit more of a blue tone in this picture, the last thing that we're going to do is come down here to the temperature and we're going to adjust for the coloring. We're going to do a bit of a little color balance operation. So because it's a blue we don't want to go back and to the blue end of things uh, over here on this side of the temperature bar, but we want to bring it more over to the yellow. And right now this is what the picture looks like zeroed out. And we want to go over just a little bit. Not too far or we'll end up with the opposite problem and, and this cat will look way too yellow and orange. And we want to make sure that the whites basically still remain white but the medium tone of his fur where he is brown looks more brown than blue. It will bring out better color definition. And we'll just go back up here and readjust our levels. And that is how you do basic color balance in iPhoto.